Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com and this is an update on the five hot stocks that I've chosen to trade as a trial for, for 2019, just to show you those that uh, uh, those that are part-time swing trading stocks can actually uh, make uh, a reasonable amount of money just by picking five stocks for the year. So most of them now are out. We've had some great trades this year so far. We're closing off May. Uh, we've had two, four, six, eight, nine trades. We've had one loss, but overall, 1,450% times profit. So if you'd have risked 1% of your account balance, you would have won 14.5% on your account balance in profit right now. We've got one open trade on PTC. We'll talk about that in a minute. It's a longer term swing, six months. Um, but I think when you look at this list now, we've had some good trades on, on all of these really. Uh, UMP into Adobe, Costco have had one big trade. Uh, so we're looking pretty good. We, we've been, we're in some volatile times at the moment with um, China uh, tariffs and everything like that. So it's good to stay out, let, let things settle down. So we'll have a quick look through the stocks and see what I think right now. So remember, PTC was swinging this off the weekly time frame. It had poor earnings recently. We've pulled back on those earnings. Again, we haven't taken the stop out. Longer term swing, we're looking for the bottom of this uh, trench on to hold and for it to resume back into its main um, bullish trend, a longer term bullish trend as well. Remember, these five are five stocks that I chose that are gro high growth stocks. So PTC is in a little bit of a prof loss making position right now. Um, but, you know, we've got some big profits already in the bank. We just let this one run. We're about about minus 50 percent times risk there on PTC. We may actually add to this if we go down to the daily time frame. If we get some more signals, we may add to this position or, or put a, another trade on a different account. At this moment in time, though, we do we do seem to be holding pretty well, um, but the, there's no at this moment in time. I don't really want to put anything on. So Adobe, this was the last one to close 160 percent. Now this is quite a messy chart, so let's just clean this up a little bit, taking some of these. Um, uh, here so here we go remember this was the original entry here for this this latest trade uh, we did get some good highs here uh, then we put a trading stop just underneath this support level and these markets being negative uh, and volatile quite recently took out this trading stop and took the profit now we're in this corrective sequence at the moment on Adobe and we've just got to find some decent support which doesn't seem to be happening right now uh, we may we may have to go down to four hour time frames and, and things like that but I long weekend Memorial weekend coming up no plans on putting anything together right now just want to give you a quick update where we are uh, and there's no rush with this type of swing trading you make hay when the sun shines you don't try and force trades were a great profit for the year so far to be honest if we had no more trades for the rest of the year 14 and a half percent uh, you would not get that in a high interest account in a bank on your savings. So this is good profit so far. UMP. Okay, so UMP, we've traded this recent fifth wave move. We are we're looking at the, it keeps rejecting these lows on high volume here. Uh, we are looking for some other entries, but at this moment in time, the, the pullback isn't deep enough. Uh, again, we're going to look at this next week. Uh, Costco. We are just keep going higher. When we look at Costco here, uh, we, we had this big one trade here all the way up. Now this now what this was a fifth wave, but it's gone that long. It's now a new third wave. We're making all time highs on Costco. We have to wait for a pullback and be patient. If that takes three months, it takes three months. You know, we've got we've got earnings coming up at the end of this month, at the end of May. If earnings aren't great, that could be the catalyst for a profit taking pullback into our zones. Uh, and then we're ready for looking for another trade. And then finally into chip sector suffered with Huawei um, and everything at the moment. So this is broken out of the channel. Remember, we, we traded this channel. This was a really great trade here on into now we're just waiting for some support Look, we've had a one two three four five we, we go down to a 240 on here and we can see now we're probably going to come in short on onto there um, 
and look at to test this this support level first before we before we go along again so we're looking okay we've had some great profits this year so far remember it's a year project just project just to show you that part-time traders swing trading stocks uh, can, can pick a handful of stocks and really do well from them for the year so so that's it have a great long weekend um, and we will update you as soon as we start putting new orders on for these five hot stocks for 2019